Hey guys, this is actually my second trailer reaction of the night, but this is in a dark sky here reacting to the second trailer for Uncharted. Uh, I haven't seen this trailer yet, but it does look exciting. It's Tom Holland, Mark Wahlberg, and Tan Antonio Banderas, the bad guy. Um, from what I am understanding about this movie, it's kind of aiming at a little before and during, like, and Uncharted 1, but a little before. Uh, either way... I'm just going to get into this trailer. I just want to get right into it, watch it, and hopefully this will be pretty good. Hey, kid. A little young for a bartender, aren't you? A little old for prom, aren't you? With everything in here. Why the map? It's the biggest treasure that's never been found. Five billion, easy. But it's just a story. <laughs> I beg to differ. Five hundred years ago, my family found the world's biggest fortune, then was betrayed. People have been searching for it all in vain. Both of you turn your keys clockwise at the same time. Ah! Thanks a lot. You almost got me killed. Clockwise, Sully? Well, it was 50-50, so I made a guess. Clearly. Voyage was not just about gold, it was something much more valuable. This girl has a very tragic history, so much blood. I'm pretty sure he just threatened to kill me. Oh, this is gonna suck! Don't get caught. You were just gonna leave me back there. Somebody had to get the cross. Cool. <laughs> Your brother believed that there was a final piece. Well, you know my brother's sick? You have no idea who you partnered with. What else aren't you telling me? The victor is Boyles. How are they going to get them out of here? Ooh. What is that thing on your face? Yeah, puberty's right around the corner, kid. You can grow your own. Exclusively <laughs> in movie theaters. Exclusively in movie theaters. That's very interesting. Very interesting that we have to say that nowadays. But either way, um, February 18th. That's not too far. That's actually before the Batman movie, which I also did a reaction to tonight. I'm um, kind of going back. So this might come out ahead of the Batman one. I'm not sure. Uh, looks great. Um, oh, IGN's got a little game versus movie trailer playing scene comparison thing here. That's cool. So, yeah, um, I think Tom Holland will be great as Nathan Drake. I don't have a problem with Tom Holland as Nathan Drake. Mark Wahlberg, I think, can be fine as Sully. Uh, it looks cool, and the big thing here is it's Uncharted. Uh, we need exploration. We need big set pieces. Uh, and we need action, action sequences on those big set pieces. And it certainly looks like that's what we're getting here uh, by the ships getting lifted up in the air and an actual pirate battle being being like taking place, like not actual pirate battle, but it's, it's supposed to be reminiscent of a pirate kind of battle of the two ships and they're fighting on the ships, which is crazy to me. Uh, blows my mind um and also it looks like there will be that little bit of a time jump from on uh, in the first game if you haven't played the first game there's a time skip at one point towards pretty 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 early on in the game where nathan ends up captured and Sully has to come there and rescue him and he does and so that's pretty cool that they're doing that it seems like they're staying pretty true to the to the uh to it's true to form, true to the to source material. 
uh, it, it, I don't know, dude. I'm looking forward to it. I think it's actually going to be pretty good. Now, here's my thing. Because I know, I know, I know there's going to be people that come into this expecting a one-to-one copy of the game. And that's never going to happen. And it, it it seems like they're copying the, the main bullet points here. The main things that they want to hit uh, to make sure this is this seems like Uncharted in a movie form, you know. Um, but I think a lot of people really what they want is like... All the cutscenes and the major action stuff just not played by them, you know, and they can't do that because the game is in, not insanely long, but it is way longer than one movie could do. And yeah, you could make the argument, well, split it up into several movies, but no, they're not going to do that. That's what, too much time, too much money, too much effort. It, it, so it seems like they're they're getting the major things here. And they're still making it fun. And I think at the end of the day, that's all I want out of an Uncharted movie. I want that exploration. I want the fun. I want the action. I'm a pretty big Uncharted fan. I've played every Uncharted game. And I've loved every minute a minute of each each and every game i actually don't have any problems with any of the games i love them i i but what is cool here is they actually seem to be like referencing things that weren't referenced so heavily until later in the series so we're getting larger references or at least in the trailer we're getting larger references to his brother uh um nathan's brother um and we're seeing side characters and stuff already. Um, what's her name? Chloe from Uncharted 1, I believe is her name. Chloe, Chloe Frazier, yes. Uh, now, but here's my thing, and this brought it up too. This, this uh, actually shows it here as well. Um... She's a recurring character in the Uncharted series. Is her first? Where is her? Yeah, she is in. She's in the comic, and she then she goes straight to Uncharted Two. So we don't see her in Uncharted One, and I didn't think we did, but I wasn't sure. Either way, I, I'm not super super upset by that at the minute like at the moment that's it still depends on what they do with that uh and i don't know if that's supposed to be chloe frazier um but i think it is let's see uncharted movie cast and it'll probably tell us yes that is chloe frazier so that's weird that's weird to me (laughs) that we're seeing chloe frazier so early but that's it's again it's not a deal breaker I think that's a maybe, and maybe I don't know. Maybe it is showing some of the comic stuff, some of the stuff that happens in the comic and the Uncharted comic. Maybe it's showing some stuff that happens in Uncharted Two. I'm not sure. Uh, I believe Uncharted Two they reference they they reference the fact that they've met before. I'm I could be wrong. Uh, it's been forever since I played those games. I'm actually going to replay those games on my stream over on twitch.tv slash zenithdarksky when they come to PC. I'm going to probably buy them on PC or PS5 and play through those games on stream as well. So be sure to come by and check me out there. And uh, feel free to tell me I told you so when I turn out to be wrong about something when I get back to it in the game. But either way, uh, it's going to be a fun time, and I think this game, this movie is going to be a fun time. I think this is going to be one of the better game-to-movie adaptations. Uh, I like that a lot of game-to-movie adaptations recently have started to really take kind of a turn on it. Instead of trying to be so true to it, just do what's fun. Like, the Sonic the Hedgehog movie was very much aimed at children and everything, but it was fun. It was a fun time. It was a good time to watch it. And, you know, I, I liked it. And I, I'm, I used to read the Sonic comics, and I was a huge Sonic the Hedgehog fan. And that movie, it, it just felt like a, a love letter to Sonic fans while also appealing to kids. And I think that's great. And I think that's kind of what a lot of these things are going for. But this will be interesting because I believe this is the first PlayStation movie, like PlayStation Pictures movie or whatever they're called, their studio is called. Uh, and I think we're getting, then we're getting The Last of Us um, as well. So this this is like going to kick us off into the PlayStation cinematic universe, uh, if we're going to call it that. So I think this is, ooh, maybe Lara Croft, maybe t- uh, the Tomb Raider, new Tomb Raider movies are that way instead. Uh, I'm not sure though. Uh, but either way. 
tell me what you guys think down below in the comments, and you can tell me whether I'm right or wrong about some of that stuff that I said. Uh, you won't hurt my feelings any. Hit, sh hit the like button, though, if you do like the trailer and you like my reaction to it. Also, if you did, share it around and hit that sub button because 90% of you guys are not subbed to me and it hurts my feelings. Let's blow this channel up here in 2022. Um... Let's feed my family <laughs> in 2022, um, and let's 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 build a little bit of a YouTube community. I have a great community on Twitch, and I'd love to see the YouTube community grow as well. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.